What's up YouTube? Welcome to another video. In this video I'm going to show you how to change the global path variables on a Linux box. I'm using Linux Mint, but this method will work on any Linux distro that has access to etc environment uh, file. So I know for sure this is going to work for Ubuntu and Debian. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to open our terminal and we're going to use Vim to edit the environment file. If you don't have Vim, you can use whatever text editor you have. Um, so let's type in Vim and then access or the path uh, to access our environment variable, which is going to be slash etc environment. Uh, we're going to go in to here. And if you're using Vim, we're going to need to press I to make sure we can actually make changes to this file. And let me just make this bigger. And we're going to go to the end of this file and I'm going to create an environment variable that I want to create. So for me, I want to add Android SDK uh, to my path. So I'm going to create an environment variable called Android Home. Um, guys, remember that this is not a script, so you cannot use shell scripting in this file because it's not, it's not going to work. It's actually going to screw up your uh, pathing and you may not be able to log in <clears throat> at the next uh, boot of your system if you do decide to use some scripting in this file so be careful with that so my environment variable is android home i'm gonna say equals to and in here i'm gonna put uh, the path to my android sdk and also one thing to note when you say equal don't put any spaces before or after the equal sign. So let me just open up my Android SDK, copy the location, and I'm just gonna paste that location right in here. So now I can basically uh, save this um, change and I'll have Android home variable, but that variable is not going to be in my path. So to actually have this variable in my path, I also have to make change to the path value itself. And because it's not a script, I cannot say path equals path, you know, uh, dollar sign path, uh, semicolon. I actually have to put or uh, append uh, whatever value I want to have in my path to the path itself right here. So I'm going to just do semicolon and paste. Uh, the same path to my Android uh, SDK that I have pasted into Android Home environment variable. So now I can actually go ahead and save that with WQ. <clears throat> okay, and it says I cannot save it because I did not open this as sudo. So I don't actually have write privileges. So I'm going to exit without making any changes and I'm going to open this up again as sudo and now I'm gonna make my changes again all over just do the same thing let's see Android home equal to that and actually I put a lowercase n in here change that all right so that's good to go I'm gonna press escape uh, hold shift press semicolon then do WQ for write and quit and press enter so now uh, to actually activate those changes I have to reboot my system I'm not actually going to reboot it uh, once you reboot the system you'll be able to do echo for Android home and you'll see the value or whichever uh, variable you create you'll see the value for that variable and then when you do echo uh, for the path, you'll also see that in the path, uh, those changes in the path uh, variable itself. So just go ahead and do reboot uh, and you'll see those changes. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like the video, subscribe and share. Take care, guys.